So sometimes when you're a toy collector, you come across one particular piece or in my case, some particular pieces that needs to be added to my already growing and overflowing collection of articulated plastic people and their vehicles. Okay, that was quite a mouthful. While I unbox this beaut of a toy, let me just tell you a little bit about how I got him. I was scrolling through Facebook because I'm jobless, worthless. Okay, that's enough self-loading. A seller from a Facebook toy group was selling this. Yeah, I'm still unboxing this. I was like, hey, and then he was like, hey, and I was like, I want to buy this. And he was like, sure. And uh, here we are. Yes, he did use a lot of bubble wrap. It's going to take a while. By the way, the seller Harshit and Moksh Toys made the whole deal a very nice and a smooth experience. No, they aren't sponsoring this video, but it's just a shout out to them because I'm a nice guy and that's what nice guys do. Oh, and it's unboxed. Yep, it is the Jazzwares Halo Warthog and Master Chief. It is the Jazzwares Halo Warthog and Master Chief. The Warthog and Master Chief was like a Master Chief. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Yes, I finally have it in my possession. Yes! Oh, I feel so blessed. Looking at this, my childhood just came rushing back to me. I mean, it's Halo, it's Master Chief, and of course, it's my love at first sight. The Warthog. Sorry, wife, but she was my first. I hope you understand. Those of you who have played Halo and are fans just like myself will understand what I was going through. This is something about Army Green, futuristic super soldier and a vehicle that is literally a dead machine. Take them all together and voila, you have a chef's kiss of a game. I geeked out so much that I kept on looking and look, uh, uh, no, uh, no, wait, I wasn't looking, I was ogling, yes, that's the word, I was ogling at this piece of plastic marvel. The wheels look top-notch, heavy-duty, battle-ready ass kickers, the bodywork is great and painted pretty well, I might add. The undercarriage looks so well-defined and detailed and the driver's seat with the controls look really really nice sticker and all man and they've even sculpted the gas and the brake pedals along with the gearbox nice the machine gun looks heavy duty and oh yeah i remember being a badass with this baby putting everything together is easy and ta-da presenting the halo warthog and master chief now that's like the 800th time i said this in the video i mean come on it's halo right come on and what should i say about the master chief he has little weight to him so the plastic does not feel cheap articulates quite well yes the shoulders do not go up to the side but you can work with him he poses really 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 well yes he poses so well poses did I just say poses? Well, you know what that means, don't you? Oh, yeah. I clicked him from every angle possible and known to man. And he poses really well. But I went a little overboard and clicked him a bit too much. I mean, come on. It's the Halo Warthog and Master Chief. Okay, I really got to do better and come up with a better line. I really got to come up with a better line. Yeah. Should have probably rewritten the script a couple of times before uh, recording my voice, but uh, here we are. Well, I did play the game driving the Warthog showing the Covenant who's boss. Yes, the bad alien guys are the Covenant for those of you who do not know or have been living under a rock. I mean, it is the Halo Warthog and never mind. After I realized that this piece deserves a display of its own, I did just that. Put him on display so that I can have a look at him all the time. I mean, after all, it is the Halo 
Oh, you know the rest. In all seriousness, though. Yes, I can get serious sometimes. This piece may not seem worth a lot to a whole bunch of people, but to me, it's my love for Halo and some very happy times. And of course, nostalgia. That's what these giant corporation making plastic toys feed on. Yes, they play with our nostalgia. That's what they do. Anywho, if you've liked this unboxing, then do let me know in the comments. Do drop a like. This really helps out the channel, guys. And, uh, you know, when you do these things, I can continue to make such crazy video for you guys. Okay, let me just do a take two. I can continue to make such crazy videos for all of you. Thank you for joining us today. And uh, like I always say, till all are...